Today I'm going to be doing a comparison between the, it's called the Gillette Skin Guard. It's for people with sensitive skin. Keeps you from pushing too hard against the skin. There's like plastic safety deals on it that only let the razor go down a tiny bit. Whereas something like this uh, Harry's Five Blade Razor I'm going to be comparing it to. Um, these type of razors you can push down as hard as you want and the razor can really dig into your skin sometimes. So the theory behind the skin guard is to keep you from scraping your skin so much and uh, keeps you from getting uh, ingrown hair, skin bumps, skin irritation, what whatnot. So if you have sensitive skin and uh, razors tear your skin up, this one's definitely for you. I just don't like it because of it leaves too much stubble behind. Just barely any stubble, but still not the comfortable shave you're gonna get with this. But I'll start with the skin guard. I always uh, run my blades under hot water to heat the blades up. Kind of opens up the pores as you shave. And then I rinse with hot water too. And I shave with the grain and then go against the grain. So here we go with the skin guard. So I already went over it one. It is, it is a really quick, uh, comfortable shave. Just there's still a lot of stubble as I go over it the second time. So it is a perfectly fine razor. It's kind of hard to tell with the video, but uh, most comfortable razor you're gonna get on the market, but as long as you don't want mind the five o'clock shadow, not quite five o'clock shadow, but it's just a tiny bit of stubble that leaves behind, but it is, it's the price you have to pay for the uh, most comfortable shave you're gonna get. So I'll go ahead and start with the Harry's Hot Blade on the other side. <coughs> Not a real fan of the Harry's razors, but we'll see how it does. I'm not a fan of the Harry's razors, but I am a fan of five blade razors. They have so many blades that it actually feels pretty much just as comfortable as the skin guard right out of the gate. Uh, I do see the Harry's. My problem with the Harry's is they don't get as close as the Gillette razors. And I don't know if it's because there's less space between the blades or what, or quality of the blades. But uh, even the Harry's blades, even some stubble behind a little bit. I'm 
it's starting to get a little uncomfortable as I go over it a second time. And uh, usually if I wait a little bit, you'll see some necks pop up with the Harry's Five Blade from trying to get close. Whereas with the Gillette razors, much more comfortable of a shave. Unfortunately, I am going to have to go over the skin guard si side with the uh, Harry's Five Blade Razor. So I see one little nick popping up over here with the Harry's Five Blade. Um, so if you have sensitive skin, definitely go with the skin guard. You just have to live with the five o'clock shadow. <clears throat> but, uh, I don't know if you can see the little black dills in between the blades or the, the white block in between the blades just keeps you from pressing down too hard. I mean, the blades just barely got enough reach, not quite enough to get a close shave. If you want a comfortable, closer shave, definitely go with the, any five blade razor, but i definitely go with the uh, a Gillette five blade razor. But in this competition, the Harry's five blades, definitely the winner, not by much, but uh, just because of the closer shave. Skin guard gets the edge in comfort, Harry's with the closer shave, but uh, oh, I see another nick popping up. I don't like the Harry's razors because they tend to nick up my skin more. So, but it did beat the skin guard as far as a quick uh, closer shave, but comfort definitely the skin guard. <laughs>